This is amazing. Uh, this is Jeffrey Gurian. This is Jeffrey Gurian. We're here with Jeffrey Gurian. Yeah. How are you, Jeff? I'm wonderful. Absolutely. Tonight, Jeffrey Gurian is uh, at Le Gisou Theater along with Nick Kroll and John Mullaney here at Just for Laughs. Have you been coming to Just for Laughs long, Jeffrey? More than 25 years. Wow, thank you so much. Yeah. Jeffrey Gurian. Yeah, Ladies and gonna... gentlemen, Jeffrey, Jeffrey Gurian. Gurian. We'll see, and he'll be on the show tonight. <laughs> you know what you're talking about. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? How, How are, are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. Good Pleasure. To... Happy New Year. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, it's perfect that we're seeing you today for Martin Luther King Day mm -hmm. because you are living the dream. Oh, thank you, man. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> when, when Martin spoke about a dream, I think this is it for you, right? Uh, so far. So far, so good. Uh, let's say it's more dreaming to go, though, so I'm not complaining at all. Mm -hmm. Well, you got two million followers on Twitter now, right? Three. Three. three million. Don't short me okay, a million. When I saw three. last time, you only had a million. <laughs> Great to see you, Kevin. You too, man. Thanks. What's, up? Thanks What's up, guys? How you doing, man? Good to see you, man. Good to see you, you too. As well. What's up? Congratulations, first of all, on all of your success. Thank you, it's been man. amazing. Thank you. Thank you. When we first met, you had two million followers. Now I think you have fifty million. Yeah, it's like fifty-five. It's a good thing. Yes, it's growing up a little bit. You and you told such great stories last night, but you said one thing that really struck me. They asked you if you were going to go back to stand up. And you said something about there's no Jim Carrey to sell anymore. Could you explain to me what you meant by that? I wrote it because it really stuck with me. It really resonated. With me. Well, I think that it resonates because it's the truth of everybody. You know, we spend our whole lives trying to invent ourselves and trying to figure out, you know, what this is. You know, and it's and it's just a collection of abstract ideas. You know, from your your ethnic background to your nationality to your you know whatever all of that stuff those are all ideas you've been given exactly you know and so when you end up at the end of it you you might be successful but you're unhappy and you don't know why because oh this thing didn't work this is not a this is not a real thing it's something i cobbled together and uh and uh, well then what is the real thing and the real thing is everything <laughs> it's so interesting that you said that the only reason that you're Jim Carrey is because your parents called you that. You could have been anybody. Exactly. I always think about that about myself. Yeah. I'm Jeffrey Gurian because my parents chose that name. I'm DNA. I'm a bunch of cells, man. Yeah, and Jeffrey means go eat him up. <laughs> it's so Jeffrey cool. Jeffrey means make us look good. <laughs> right? It, incredible. It's just incredible. Gilbert is my favorite comedian in the world. I thought, I closed my eyes and I thought he was in the room. He's my. Fa he's always <laughs> been my favorite comedian. Yeah, yeah. Always. Affleck! Yeah. <laughs> And then here they come. It's a story all about how my life got flipped, turned up. And his harmonica is more melodic, and then Bob Dylan is different because he kind of just picks the highest note of the harmonica and just blows it. So he's just like. <laughs> you know, whatever. so it's like that. So, but you, you, I hear those little things, and I, I, I go like, oh, that's the difference between those two harmonicas. Well, I am so happy to have a, had a chance to spend Please. time with you here. Oh, the the man, comedy me? matters, you guys. The man who made Lorne Michaels laugh, <laughs> and I'm backstage with him. How amazing is that, right? right. How incredible! You're is the that? best, Jeffrey. Thank you so much, buddy. You too, man. It's so great to see you. That's right. the coolest white man on the face of the earth. He's white on the outside, black on the inside, baby. So tell me. Everybody black to the police show. Yeah. <laughs> Seth, say hi. How are you? Yeah, good to see you. How's good it going? You, What's How happening? Did you see Nick Kroll earlier? <laughs> he made me this jacket. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah. yeah. I was the, I was the head of security last yeah. night at Oh Hello. Oh, that's awesome. And I gave the tuna fish sandwich to Judd Apatow. That's so it funny. It was hilarious. Oh, that's yeah. great. <laughs> yeah, we're it's coming to Broadway, you know. Yeah, yeah. I've heard. I yeah. saw it in L.A. just a few, uh, about a month ago or so. Amazing show. Right? It's great. So I'm the head of security. So you have to deal with me. I would do. I guess so. <laughs> John Oliver, how are you, man? Oh, I haven't seen you in the longest time. It's going great. Absolutely great. It's obvious how much joy you have when you come out on stage, and you spread that joy to everyone who's there. Only with you. Jeffrey Gurian would say some stuff like that. <laughs> Only you. It's true. It's true. I speak the truth. I, I love what I do, and I and I love, and I feel blessed that I'm able to do it and have done it. Now, I am so politically correct. I don't even take the N train. <laughs> <laughs> Why, you be late all the time. That's right. You be late. I just skip that shit completely. Yeah, yeah, that's it. I just go a different way. It only goes I'm afraid to even ask anyone where the N train is. <laughs> it only goes to Harlem. That's, that's it. It goes from Brooklyn to Harlem. And it always stops on Martin Luther King Boulevard. <laughs> where I feel so at home. 
<laughs> well, you you kind of fit in everywhere. I've never seen you like. You know why you fit in everywhere? Because there's no one like you. There's no one like you. So it's. <laughs> it's you know how long you've been in my life? At least 20, 25 years, man. That's how long. That's how long we go back. You saw wow. something to me. Bob Saget, hey, oh my God. Here it is, Jeffrey. <laughs> this is amazing. We? Here are Bob we. Yeah, this Look is unbelievable. And your hair is more fertile than ever. Yeah. I got, I got so nervous. <laughs> it's great to see you, brother. Always good to see Always you. Always so good, you, man. man. I love you, too. Love you, too. You're the best. You are, man. <laughs> So what, what cologne is that? That's pretty fly. I haven't made for you. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Yeah. How did you take the name JB Smooth? Would you tell me again? Because I love that story. <laughs> you know what? Like in that dancing crew, I was uh, I was I was just J Smooth, and my partner was J Groove, and we were, we we would dance behind R and B groups, R and B R and B groups, and and, and behind. Uh, rap groups, and what happened was, you know, when I started doing stand up, I added the B and I became JB Smooth. Awesome. <laughs> I want y'all to keep uh, supporting comedy, right. support JB Smooth, support the movement, the journey, and all that good stuff. Work with the damn universe to make this thing happen, and we'll have a good time bringing the ruckus. All right, y'all be good. JB Smooth, this is how he does it. <laughs> so good to see you, brother. How are you, man? How are you? Man? How are you? you good? I'm great. Great to man. see you, good Jeff. To see good to see you. Man. I recently saw Afraid of the Dark. Your impression of Mandela teaching Obama to speak <laughs> is masterful. Master I, Thank I you very much. Blown Thank you away. very much. Thank you. How long did you work on that piece? I, I don't even know. I don't know when that came about. Maybe, maybe it might have been like three or four months before the special. And I, I noticed, you know, because Obama was, was leaving and you would hear him speak all the time. And I noticed his cadence and his ideas. And, and then I came to realize, I was like, no, man, this, this guy sounds familiar. And I guess uh, that's what comedy is, is observing. You know it very well. I know it very well, but Mandela's voice, would you do something in Mandela's voice? Uh, I would say, uh, I would say, uh, uh, make sure you watch uh, my good friend, uh, Jeffrey Quarren. Enjoy his show. <laughs> That's fantastic. Yo, it's the world champion, Judah Friedlander, and I want you to watch Comedy Matters TV and subscribe. Why? Because it's hosted by Jeffrey Gurian, best hair in the business. I'm here with Bill Burr on the red carpet. He's getting the comedy the stand-up comedian of the year award to a lot of people you've been the stand-up comedian of the year for a long time thank you you're welcome thank you. Uh, you know last you hang time. around long enough they're going to give you something jeff last time i saw you was at the patrice o'neill memorial coat? it is yeah no it's all it's like a matching thing oh i get it yeah you get it you're you took the lining out and you popped the collar <laughs> yeah there you go m style <laughs> you know how we do it M absolutely style. Let's look at the outfit. What do you think, Sarah? What do you think of Jeff's I, outfit? I feel like we've moved forward. We've gotten away from the reds and the blacks. Yes, we're and into I, the whites. And we're into summer. Yeah. And we're in summer. Now white. we've got we've got a we've got a pop with collar a pop and color. then and then with we've got a match, but it's not a it's not a matching kerchief. It's, new, it's no, not matchy matchy. This is it's the print. Matchy, it's got a hint of the color yeah. pop of color yeah. jeans because this is comedy. It's <laughs> casual. <laughs> right. yeah. Oh, you're you're addressing me here, huh? What are you doing? For you, man. You're a stand-up comedy person of the year. I can't uh, show up like a schlum. I understand that. I understand. Everybody, do not mess with this man right here. I trained him, okay? You cannot penetrate his defense. You cannot survive his offense. Stay away. Right. Show My, respect. Respect, right. My force field yeah. you know, comes from my hair. Yeah. Best hair in the business, dude. Not even close. <laughs> Not even close. How are you? So good. So happy to see you. Did you knit this? I knit, yes, I spent up all night. Is this real gold? Is this spun gold? gold? And it has batteries and it lights up. Isn't wow. Crazy? I personally can't believe it. Jeffrey, I love your hair. It's always... How much time do you spend on your hair? A lot. Yeah. A lot. When I travel, I have a whole suitcase just with hair products. There you go. It's amazing. You always hold the mic so close to my tits. I, I told you, I, I can't like help it because my tits. <laughs> it's just because they're so big. I can't. I have to step back. 34D. It's That's going to be the headline of this video. Only if you want it to be. I do. You know what? It works. I'm sure they like they only they have a Jeffrey Gurian collection of clothes. They only sell to you. Does this thing have a volume knob? Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> and I figured the one place I could wear it comfortably would be with you. Because you know style. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. And 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 you and you and you and you do too. 
<laughs> the mic out of my tits. Okay. Uh, someone stole Richard Lewis's hair and put it on you. I'm so sorry, Jeffrey. It's quite alright. Good hey, to see you. Going, it's going good. You've done your hair especially for me. Just for you, man. Ted, your hand's so close to my boobs, oh, I can't even believe it. <laughs> you need more kids, though. That's the thing. I know. Five. We're thinking you could play one of the kids. I could. Can we do that? Hello, this is Triumph, the insult comic dog. And when I'm not watching the internet, I make a point of not watching Comedy Matters TV with Jeffrey Gurian. Go!